another perfect night in downtown Phoenix. Rangers took a 2-1 series lead last night. Took this crown. Come on inside. Yeah, we say welcome inside the broad problems. That's not the case anymore, though. And as we line up for dueling bullpen. Texas Rangers, the regular season wasn't great. The bulk of their bullpen, looting situation, the winning formula has been outstanding for Bruce Bochy. Timing has been great because the last two months has been outstanding. It John doesn't matter how well they pitch if they don't get more offense than they did last. Super important. You're talking about the rookie of the year. When they win, he's doing something. Look for Carroll early in the game to do something special. Hey, what a day to be alive. We got Halloween. We got game four of the war. This time of Mr. October. That ball is gone! And everybody's good. Of the World Series. Next. All set. Welcome to the 2023 World Series on Fox, presented by that album. Fitting to get us going for game four. There is some big news. Out for the rest of the series, as is Max Scherzer. Garcia took a cut and driven in a record 22 runs is a huge blow. And the Rangers had also spoke, telling his teammates, I'm Mom Verducci. Well, thanks, Ken. The World Series spotlight. Our Corey Seager is right in the middle of it. Three, check again. Corey Seager has hit more World Series home runs than Ernest is off the charts. What will he do next? Marcus Simeon and Corey Seager at the top of the order, and they drove in all three runs. Stays in the cleanup spot. Josh Young hit fifth for most of the season. And Travis Jankowski makes his World Series debut in right field in place of guys. Has just one home run, though. Ronald Perdomo has done some good things out of the bottom of the season game. You think about how many innings are you going to go? Tonight is going to be about six batters. So when you come in the game, you've got to be two thirds. Who wins the third, the first three innings, and who's leading after the the second is from its first world championship. Off we go. Let's track one. Now Marcus Simeon. Rangers got three runs in the third. That's all they'd need. One ball, one strike. Oh, man, players can get three outs. Southside. One, two, three, seventh in this postseason. Now in the major leagues. Finally did at the age of 30 a couple years back. Found it late and a key role in this postseason. Well, one thing he's when he's behind in the count. So call him with a full count pitch. That is out of play. Yeah, we'll do the full count pitch. Gabby Moreno at bat that evened themselves out. Still was not. Another payoff pitch. And Simeon sends another foul on the eighth pitch. Simeon grounds on the backhand play. The defense in this fall classic spot. Really some clutch plays and key moments. Well, they got to talk fast. Seeger is probably swinging right over. Swings it there. And it sometimes comes with that. It's a very. So here comes Mitch Garver. Who has hit third in this postseason? Swings away first pitch here. When you when you're good, see what he gets on the second pitch. It is another change. Takes this one from on a one-one pitch. First swings and misses. One and two at hand. Well, it's only going to be fun. And if I try to get it off and roll, one, two, three, and one ball, two strikes. Championship series win. It went almost to perfection, and he plans to. You know, the pitching coach and Brent Strom all having the. Another one two pitch. The way his mind works. Challenge of a chest at each inning. Payoff pitch. Garver sends it foul. He saw Miguel Castro. That has been one of the best in baseball the last. Garver takes a two out walk. Eat in that outfield. We've seen it show up a few times in this World Series. Already a nice play. And a spinner in there for strike one. Next year. So this limited use again. On this 0 1, Carter right. takes strike two. Metaplies 0 2. Thomas scored his first inning for Metaplies. Here's another one I believe went off the scoreboard. Left hander on the mound. It's Marte to lead off, and then Carroll hitting second. Trying to get Gabriel Moreno. Mission. Guriel bat six. Thomas Rivera and Perdue moved into the bullpen at the start of September and has worked in both. But the big key is going to be his fastball command on the end. But he's just funky enough to get hitters off of how he can use his bullpen. There is reached that middle third of the game. 
Well, another day, another hit for Cattell Marte, who's He's doing this a lot. You see the second baseman up the middle, but he pulls it to the left side of Corbin Carroll. I think this strike one. I mean, we talked about it offseason. I hate to pin two of the year. The stats point out the importance in this post burst in game two. Well, he's been so dominant against right handed pitchers. A has... couple looks over to first comes. Oh, man. And oh. Joss misses. T, if he throws it again there, that'd be hard to call it a ball twice. Arizona Sam. It's not where you want to throw, but it's hard to hit. It's like getting it to do something totally different, and it just stays there in your eye. Here's Moreno, who hit a home run to open the scoring in game two. All four, which would have brought the tying run to the plate. Down the line, foul. And Moreno, and he hits a lot of ground balls. But when he gets a ball, this one gone, score this first inning. That right. is a strike over the outside. So he gives the illusion that it's going to be a strike. He just pitches it. After three. Down, so now that's two disengagements to get him. He's not going. And Moreno fouls it off. And you know, during the regular season, it's just a few day stretch where he's not getting a hit. And the 23 year old sends another foul. Swings through it. Back to back K's for him. Right field. He is a good defensive right fielder. Young and Seeger left center. And they give Christian Walker another encouraging hand. He finally had his moment with the lead. On this 1 0 pitch, Walker fouls it off. Well, he certainly, the six at bats have been so encouraging, even if some have not resulted. There he goes on a 1 1 pitch to tie. Heinz throw is in time. After scoring this first game, he comes home and gets strike one. Well, that might be with. Uh... A man applies not gotten more than four outs in any of his go down to the Garcia injury. All right. One ball, two strikes. Fastball's upstairs, and it's two and two season on this 2 2 pitch. Young drop all the way to the wall. Josh Young headed for first base hit of the game. Doing an incredible job driving the ball in that gap. So much room in this outfield to get him over. Somehow, some way, ground ball to the right side by left handers. And that's part of the reason why Man applied. There was a long slump September through a lot of October. On this 0 1 low, grounds it foul, and it's 0 and 2. This Rangers offense that scored just can 0 2 to the plate. Got him swinging. A strikeout that man applied for low. Us. One and a third runner at second. His hitter. Young at second. One away. And ball one. Well, Heim has been pitching the middle part of the plate, though. He has. Change up there. 2 0. Some really good numbers. On this 2 0 pitch, Heim right. takes a perfect fastball for a strike zone. And four games in this World Series gave up the walk-off. Let's go of a 2-2. And that drifts outside. Count is full on high. Here's a 3-2. There's a chop. Two. On to third, and here comes Leody Tavares. That's what he sees first pitch, but not close. Right. Slider in there for a strike. One and one. One one pitch. That's a change that Tavares lays off. That's a good one. On this 2 1, Tavares right. took a fastball strike. Got the callbacks trying to pitch around the leadoff double. Oh, Tavares takes a change in the dirt, kicks away. Play at the plate won't happen. The young scores on that play as you've got it. Moreno, you go, and he was able to score. 3 2 to Tavares is ball four. So the rain and skips in the wrong direction. He literally was in pretty good position to blow. Luis Garcia, as Kenny told us off at the top, is finished for the World Series. Who hits it? Field for a base hit. Travis Jankowski getting his a ton of power, but when he hits it, he can utilize his speed. It's this spot, Joe, where two out Rangers. First one comes home. Simeon chops it foul. They got Simeon. So Trying and a miss. One and two. Two out. A one-two pitch. Simeon. Into the corner. Tavares.
Harrison to score. Jankowski in his run. A row comes through, and it's three to nothing to the line. Simeon starting to heat up. They're going to need guys to pick up the run in a bullpen game is that you just don't know the next guy that's a lot of runs at this point. Jankowski at the bottom of the order reach and set the table for fun. Simeon. To Texas is Kyle Nelson comes in. Kyle Nelson's going to throw a lot of breaking balls, but lure to the game. Now So here's the deal that, you know, when these games, obviously nowhere close to this game being over, the more. Jarver with a check. Long throw coming for Rivera. Snaps it off and gets it. Two run triple for Marcus Simeon. One batter later. Five runs, although perhaps some concern. Water uh, tweaked his ankle a little bit. Oh. But he has been. His fourth home difference making homer, a 3 1 win. Defensive play as well. He's got an easy defensive play here. A little bit of a uh, win. Texas is already going to be without Adolis Garcia for the remainder of this world. Adolis and Seeger. And no Max Shirt. Tavares the call and the catch. I think it gets altered the more he holds this lead because now. Use their pen. Hurt. And yesterday they had the pen manager. In fact, in his last 68 games managed in the post. And they're going to score some runs. Now, whether or not they get enough. In one ball, no strikes. Game changing home runs. Arizona's got you to get back into this one. Hardly any runs to Texas the rest of the way. And that's the pro. Alec Thomas. Sends a long run for Carter. Foul ball. Rounds, but gave up nine runs in the first two games against the D-backs. Yeah, I thought here comes the 2-2. Good stop by Heim right there. Same time, same place tomorrow for game five. There he goes. Here it comes. Thomas again. The easy one. Inning over. Run.com. Evan Carter's the hitter starting this third season. Set a record with nine postseason wins on the road. I mean, there's a lot of things that don't make sense. Chopper to a walker. Let's go down to Ken Rosenthal. Joe, it's important to remember the list. Mitch Garner out nearly two months at the start of the season. They talked about how the game as Young adds his second hit as many times up there. They had five guys, John, that were in the starting lineup for the American League. I'll be the pillar of this team, the starting pitching. Bullet times. Strike on low. It's to them. They were so good. And then they go into a in the dirt, ball and two strikes on low through the years, like with Nathaniel Lowe, who they got from Tampa Bay a couple years. And for Lowe, he's gone from his first year with him. Two and two. Benadolis Garcia, man, uh, if you're anything other way, 3 2 pitch up the middle into center field. Base hit, Nathaniel Snipes win. Going to do it for Nelson, so while man apply was solid. Double play, he tries to get it out of the glove, and then the ball just squirts out of his hand. Walker, you know, the bat for any hitter is going to come and go, but they... Right. One ball, one strike. Fastball's open. Third inning, they lead five to nothing. They've got the bases loader. All right. For a strikeout, is 2-2, is pop foul. Frias throws, and the count is full with no... Two singles in an air, loading the... The payoff. Got him to chase. This ball slider back foot. There's offense. Right. And now Jankowski is sailing if they can get out of this unscathed. Here's the 01. Oh, no. Didn't get the call. Indusky comes through again. Kicks away from Thomas. Run double from the guy getting his shot. My goodness. Sitting around. Here's ahead, 7 nothing. And now it's Gurry out of the wall. Goodbye! Marcus Sip. I don't know if I've ever seen this. I'm sure it's happened because every time I think there's no from Walker, Lumen Large. Seeger fouls it off. 
Sinker down, swinging at the high fastball, and the middle three in game four. His first pitch to Gabriel Moreno misses away for ball one. Played catcher right up until before he was as an infielder. Takes a leadoff walk here in the fourth. He hated Walker. Shot corner. Moreno is stopped at third. And Walker's got himself a double. And that's all they can do. One batter at a time. Him, but you got to make him go to the bullpen as soon as possible. You made from Casamigos. The championship series to 7 of 13 in the world. Regular treatment that he's got to go through. as a big league hitter. But his eyes as his best tool. Tommy Pham right is there. taken for strike three. It's the last pitch I think Tommy Pham thought was coming. Cuba drives the ball down the line. Foul. In a 10 nothing game. Kowski drifts back. Going to get one of them in. 10 to 1. And a sacrifice fly from Lourdes. First run of the day for the D-backs. Here comes Alec Thomas. Running with third. 2-0. Oh. Yeah, the rain. Got it. And Arizona centers for one in the fourth. 70 degree temperature. Hurt. Roof is open. Well. Got two. Last start for Ryan Nelson, even though he's a starter for much of the year. Off the field, very aggressively. Nathan Avaldi for the Rangers, Zach Gallen for the Diamondbacks. Fires. Low. Samus into the gap gets there. Away. And as a converted position player coming out of the draft, he lacked in so they could take a chance. Now that 2019 draft. And for Nelson, he says he had such a hard time seeing it at the plate. Okay. Outside corner to get Leo Tavares, so two away. Golf Rivera making the call and the catch and six up C app. Downloaded today. Right. And Drew Heaney into the fifth inning for the first time. Off by Young. The first out of the fifth. Well, one of the smaller than he is, it creates an illusion. Spencer Strider is the guy that comes to mind on that, releases it. First year in Texas. Cooper Domo. And yeah, that's ball four. He goes up to get it. His only play is at first. Marte's on the ball. And Drew Heaney with five innings. Holding the Diamondbacks. 9-1-2 coming up in this inning. That means another at-bat for Corey. Big reasons why the Rangers have a 2-1 lead. It's Corey Simeon's been perfect timing for Texas, right? Home teams this year. And remember, 24 hours oh, spent. And they're fun to lot. They signed Marcus Simeon to a set. Jankowski on 3-1. Go on in the six. Him away, and he was struggling, and those to go. No matter what, Rangers to this 9-0 record that they're on the verge of pushing to a rents. Chase is up here. That is back to you throughout the season. It is not the same group as we're seeing now. And just take a little bit off. There's not a... As they got healthy down the stretch, they'll move. Third for Young. Kurt. Doubled for the second consecutive game. His line comes off. And strike one. It's not a game they can steal bases, but looking ahead to tomorrow. And for a base hit for Walker. Recently, two outs and a wild pitch, right? I mean. They're going to be a tough play for Young. Bearhead pick up, made it close, but it didn't. Tonight by Christian Walker, he felt the energy came out of his team. Follow. Mm. Because it can turn like that. The second for one on the first double play. And you may be looking at this as it is currently. There are more staffs that are like this than. Nothing but zeros there and four strikeouts. Evan Carter here. Bowder shows off some of that athleticism there. Not that you pitchers. Kings back in their favor when it's fought against 
Just a few feet as if you are on your toes, ready to spring forward. Hurry. What's the comp you made the other day? Three hits over the first three games. This offense now. They scored 10 runs over the first and here was that they only had four the lap has been. Low lines to left ends the top of the set. A couple five run innings for the Rangers in this game and the biggest reasons they are on the verge of a 3-1 series lead. Cody Bradford comes in and he pitches I'm good. scoreless I'm good. inning in game. Bradford has that great release. I'm good. Yeah. Thomas playing the WBC here yeah. with Team Mock. They Those, have right? stuck in here and they are cheering their team. It, it's Ooh. just been like talking to people around this town. They're like, can you believe the Diamondbacks? What? Oh, Over 60 years. Oh, man. Establishing.